Alright, hey, what's up, YouTube? David here. Today, I will be your PSP 3000, 2000, 1000, go, whichever PSP you want, okay, whichever PSP you got, whichever one you want to hack, whatever. Um, this works on any firmware, I mean, this works on any, any PSP on firmware 639, which you see there. So, make sure you have version 639 installed, and there, and you will want to go ahead and install this 6.39 ohm pro b6 see now uh, a caution before you go ahead and install this this does not have a perma patch which I actually would not install even if it did because it can cause a brick perma patch is basically makes a permanent firmware to where if you restart your battery your PSP or your battery falls out, you'll still have it. But other than that, it's good. There is a 639 TN-A out, but the reason I am not making a tutorial for that is because there is no ISO loader for that firmware yet. Now I'm making a tutorial on 639 Pro B6 because this does not require an ISO loader. Alright, so you're going to get this menu, press X, and press X again, and it should start up. Um, if you do this for the first time, it will write something into your flash, so. Alright, and now, if we look back here again, it's, you have 639 Pro B6, and instead of your MAC address, it shows your PSP model number, which, this is a model 2G, so it's PSP 2000. And, you can go into game. Now, I personally have preloaded two games in here, this one being a ISO file, and this being a CSO file. Now, as you see here, they both show up. They're in my ISO folder, and I will start up Angry Birds to demonstrate. So, I, um, personally, if I, if I were to choose between 639 Pro and 639 TN, I would choose 639 TN because it is plugins than this is, because plugins thing is actually different from other firmware. But um, right now the best you guys got. Oh, well, it's not bad. It's just the only thing is that um harder to install plugins on it. But other than the plugins being hard to install, it's exactly the same. And um so 639TN, I would prefer it, but there's no ISO loader out for it. When a ISO loader comes out, I will make a tutorial on it. But for now, PSP 1000s, 2000s, 3000s goes version 639 use this hack your psp play isos all that good stuff all right well thank you for watching this video please like comment subscribe all that good stuff